as what led to the formation of the Tripartite Committee. This committee was born out of a necessity by both the APC and the SAPP government, supported by our international supporters, to restore faith in our electoral processes and to ensure that the will of the people is upheld in the most transparent and credible manner possible. On June 24, 2023, Sierra Leone held its multi-tier elections, which included presidential, parliamentary, mayoral, and local council elections. The Electoral Commission for Sierra Leone, ECSL, declared incumbent president uh, my fellow Sierra Leoneans, you will just, you will just join this live. This now the statement from Osamu, the next president of Sierra Leone. I beg you share this live because it's a very important, vital information. You don't say when I listen to Bush Radio. Now, now from the man himself, the next president of Sierra Leone. Madabio, right now, we don't tire. Osamu don't tire diplomatically. You know what I mean? Eh? But when I no say where Fulamaki don't tie cow for killer. You forget for time in one foot. Now that one foot right now, Madam, you use. You understand? But right now, diplomatically, Osamu don't tie him. Diplomatically, APC don't tie him. So now, we, all the APC, we need to come together and they be on a president, Osamu. One early morning, Osamu grab no more and say, I'm the president of the Republic of Sierra Leone. Now that time, Madam, you they know how people they hate him. Now that time, international community, they go know, see, the people of Sierra Leone are hungry. But now, Osamu talks, say, make you not fetu, make you take her easy. It's still they fight them diplomatically madam you always sabi for you all man now for just member now for paki bondu fair negotiation right now the mamina tiktok dinner texas i see i'm coming and pick her in texas they are trying to hide but madam you like you know go able to hide now america mm -hmm. you know able to hide now america you know able to hide now england they always say for go go na some side who say if this is alone people they know they you understand when i listen waiting us i'm going talk when i share this live this is a very important information i will break and down little by little Julius Marabio as the winner with 56.1% of the vote. However, this announcement was met with significant resistance and allegations of irregularities from the opposition, the All People's Congress Party, and local and international election observers. The APC, along with several observers, raised serious concerns about the electoral process before, during, and after the elections. This included a widely condemned midterm census, the introduction of the district block proportional representation system with limited consultation, the high threshold that restricted smaller parties' participation, and issues with the voter register. Operational challenges such as the poor quality of voter identification cards and delayed delivery of ballot boxes further exacerbated the situation. Allegations of bias and partisanship within the ECSL cast a shadow over its integrity and impartiality, not only to conduct the elections, but also to announce the election results. These issues led to a heightened state of tension and mistrust between the ruling SLPP government and the opposition APC. To address this political impasse, a three-day mediated dialogue was organized from October 16 to 18. This dialogue was facilitated by esteemed bodies, including the African Union, ECOWAS, the Commonwealth, and the Independent Commission for Peace and National Cohesion. Through these efforts, the Agreement for National Unity was signed between the government of Sierra Leone and the APC. It okay, Una wanna say Osamudo sell game. When I listen to talk, the Agreement for National Unity was signed by both parties. It means it was signed by APC, it was signed by SAPP, and it was signed by our international partners. The outcome of this agreement was the establishment of the Cross-Party Committee on Electoral Systems and Management Bodies Review, 
known as the Chapatite Committee. This committee was tasked with a vital mission to review and examine the electoral systems, structures, and processes of the 2023 elections. Butwa, this committee, they set the Trapatite Committee for review the electoral system for the June 2023 election. They don't say 2028. When I say, 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 or someone in what they do and in understand what they do and they fetch matter you diplomatically but where the time they reach for if diplomacy fail fail now you have get for can prevail now you know what you have it means say the people of Sierra Leone we need to go out and kick matter bio out believe in me matter bio can never fight the people's power and previous electoral cycles. Its mandate included assessing the legal framework, operational capacity of the ECSL, and proposing reforms to enhance transparency and credibility in future elections. Okay. Future election, and yeah, a lot of people be get a, they be they be they be the get a, misconception they have a misconception misconception mentality they they be the first way they say future election is going to be 2028 come on this now come on english if election going to be 2028 period they, they would have said 2028 but they say future election it means future election can even be tomorrow can even be today you understand so the tripartite committee a more get power than the supreme court of Sierra Leone. now make apc they not ever go court because they know saying that it can go court wherein the judge or uh, whosoever got go, go for preside over that case, it then at the government side. So a APC think and say, no, also I'm gonna say, what am I going? I'm, I'm not gonna waste my time. Mother be gonna spend money to do that. They say mother be okay for take money for go do that and they so what do you mean they do? Me they go through different way. Now I make Osamu the tripartite camp. And the tripartite was signed and approved by UN Security Council. It means it's more powerful than what you guys thinking. It's even powerful more than the imagination of Mother Bio. And his followers, but a lot of people, when I political thinkers, where they understand, now maybe they don't begin run away small small people like Abbas Bundu. He was he, he, he forced you have to resign because you know you know miss Pakui fire. When I listen to Osamu, the committee was co-chaired by the government, the APC, and the development partners. Okay, okay. The committee, the one that would chair the committee, the co-chair of the committee, it was by the APC. Where now Dr. Kefra Marana represents APC, now the co chairman, and uh, Dr. Hinga, a guy man, sorry, where Madame Yodo Rush for appoint and now as a secretary president, guy man, I represent the government of Sierra Leone, and this, the, 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 the UN representative to Sierra Leone, when I from Burundi, I forgot her name, of, she, she's a woman to come up from Burundi, and I represent the international partners as a co chair for the Trapatite Committee. And was composed of seven members each from the government and the APC. You see, this tripartite committee it be composed. When they say composed members, people the way they participate. Now, be seven, every group gets seven people. Them APC gets seven people. Them SFPP gets seven people, and also the international partners. Is deliberations also included engagements with representatives from civil society organizations? other critical state institutions and a wide spectrum of stakeholders across the country thereby ensuring a comprehensive and inclusive approach to its work this was an immense undertaking one that required meticulous attention to detail and a collaborative spirit the committee was given a time frame within which to complete these tasks. And despite the complexity and breadth of the issues at hand, significant progress was made. And on another momentous day, on July 1, 2024, the committee presented its report, including an outline framework of implementation of 
July 1st, then the committee presents the work, the report, then right? the committee presents them. This month, the first night, the committee presents what they do, the finding about 2023 election. We're not talking about 2028. If you are talking about 2028, you might be, you might be dumb, bruh. If you say you they talk about 2028, it means you're not a This water, we don't reach now, so we can't cross. Bruh, Yanda Kondo, therefore, eating mama. Kondo, therefore, eating mama. Election fraud. We not go allow one tunku one short man for can't take joy now the people there of Sierra Leone the hand. It's not gonna work. This now a collective responsibility for we the Sierra Leoneans then for make sure say Sierra Leone return to democratic path. When I listen to Osamu, when I share this life, make you reach every Sierra Leonean people they don't understand what Osamu talk. People they what Osamu talk they don't understand. But until we are unbelieving towards them, we when they say they will mislead the people, Samura so Kamara have no, nothing to mislead the people. The man at Technocraft now he know what he signed and is what he signed, he know what he signed. An international partner, they are ready to work with Osamu very soon. When I wait like Echo Establishment Team Kana Salon. Yes, let me have you always time for implement the recommendation. Let me see why many man can say bag of be lobby tagebuka. When I listen findings and recommendations i would like at this stage to extend my deepest gratitude to the apc team they say you go left for tell apc people the way way, way it represents apc by the tripartite committee it means a glad the job where they do man like dr kefra mara richard conte lawyer boniface and the rest led by Dr. Kaifala Mara. The team comprised Dr. Richard Conte, Honorable Ambassador Almami Pejito Kuruma, Lawyer Boniface Sidiki Kamara, Mr. David Fona, Madam Bernadette Kago, and Mr. Prince Thurley. Their dedication and hard work